black men and women across the country. We are being killed and targeted by the police and killed with impunity. And right now we are in a fight for justice. Um, we, Caleb was killed by Berkeley police and what was used to be one of the progressive, you know, cities in the world. But she was killed because she was black, because she was trans, she was disabled, and she had no rights in their mind. So, Kayla was an artist too, she was a poet, so I'm going to read one of her poems. Um, it's called My Outer Skin, and this was a poem that was published when she was 16 years old. The time of day where I like to stay can open and release my shell. But the hurt within can start and begin, my outer skin you can tell. The lies and uncomfort I gave myself, it's myself I'm starting to ask. The lies turned into clay and hardened that day, and now I'm wearing a mask. One day will come, the hurt will run, the mask will peel off again. My life I'll face and give it a base, I'll shed my outer skin. So she shed her outer skin, but she is still here. We're still fighting for her. It's been four years, so justice doesn't come quickly and it doesn't come easy, especially if you're a minority and you're not in a protected class. And as far as I can tell, that's pretty much a lot of people here. So we need to stand up to police brutality. We need to defend the rights of people who are disabled, who are in a mental health crisis. How many times have you heard the story, well, my loved one needed help, I called the police because that's the only one I can call. And right, within right. minutes, yes. they are killed, they are right. shot, mm -hmm. they are executed in their own homes. Yeah. And that's exactly what happened to Kayla. So we are finally getting our day in court, um, October 23rd in federal court. You know, they did dismiss the wrongful arrest, they dismissed the excessive, excessive force, but they kept one really important aspect in there, which is the American with Disabilities Act claim. And that basically means that police can't go into your home and do whatever kind of bullshit they want to do, especially right. if you're yes. disabled. Yes. So hopefully you can come out and support Justice for Kayla. What's the website? The website is Justice for Kayla Moore.